is a scene that slowed traffic and grabbed the attention of just about everybody walking by. Crews working to remove a car out of the Pottery Barn in Green Hills. As Kimberly Davis explains, the driver is a longtime former federal judge. As you can imagine, former federal judge Thomas Higgins is shaken up. Just take a look at the damage left behind after he made an unexpected stop at the Pottery Barn. It looked like they just like lost total control of their car and went straight into Pottery Barn. Not a scene people are used to driving by in a popular Green Hill shopping center. Now I was coming to go to the store. And as shoppers walked by, they couldn't pass the shattered storefront without pulling out their cell phones. Um, looks like they're putting it up on the tow truck. And I'm, I really wonder who's involved over there as far as who's driving the car and if they were hurt. 84 year old Thomas Higgins was the driver behind the wheel. According to Metro Police, Higgins foot got stuck on the gas and that's how he plowed into Pottery Barn crossing Hillsboro Road. Wow, there's just police everywhere and them pulling it out and it's just it was just I don't know how to I don't know how to describe it. it just Wow. People passing couldn't describe it. Pottery Barn employees didn't want crews to film it. Stop it. Metro Police say a 54 year old Pottery Barn employee was hurt after Higgins Jeep barreled into the store. Bro, it's crazy, man. He took a wide turn into the Pottery Barn. It looks like it really hit with a bunch of impact. The car looks pretty rough. Crazy things happen all the time. <laughs> The former judge turns 85 years old next month. He was not injured in this crash, but we are told he was transported to St. Thomas Hospital to be checked out. For now in Green Hills, I'm Kimberly Davis, News Channel 5. The Pottery Barn employee was treated at Vanderbilt for some cuts on her arms and legs, but is expected to be okay.